under total Soviet control. Miller's been captive for 10 days. Not much time left. Weather will clear shortly. Storm's passing. Infiltration of the Soviet main ground forces. Should be the perfect warm. <laughs> Kazuhira Miller is being held in Darwin Dehar to the north. Check its location now. Take out your iDroid. You see Wandy on the map? That's where they're keeping Miller. Only problem is, we don't know his exact location. Finding it is your first priority. Got your binoculars? Or should I say, your int scope? See the village? Straight ahead? All right, that's the village. If you see something through the binoculars and you need more information, just give me a call. I'll tell you anything I can about it. That's Violo Village, the Violo Calais. The villagers fled the war and evacuated a while back. Since then, it's become a base for the Soviets' 40th Army. A few days ago, Miller was taken through there, en route towards Dewan Dehar. You may be able to pick up the trail there. It's worth a shot. Put a marker on it so you don't lose track of where it is. Good. Now you won't have to worry about getting lost along the way. You can't have much left in him. I give him three days, Tops. If we fail, and he dies, we lose our chance of revenge. But we need more intel. If you just go charging into Doan Dehar, you'll be putting both your lives at risk. See what you can find out first. The Soviets have other outposts, not just the one you saw. Afghanistan is a big place. I expect you'll become quite familiar with those binoculars as you plan your next move. How and where you make it, well, that's up to you. From here on out, you're on your own. You're a legend in the eyes of those who live on the battlefield. That's why you have to handle this mission yourself. Put those nine years behind you. And return his big boss. That's how Koss would want it. I'll be sending additional intel by radio. Stay sharp. Not one of Miller's bodyguards survived. But they were good. All we found on the scene were their corpses and knees. You'll be missing them. And you're his only hope of getting them back. Now go! Let the legend come back to life. in those ruins. Shooting, taking cover, climbing obstacles, 
See to it that nine-year gap doesn't slow you down. That's a type of medicinal plant. Bring it back to base. It's sure to be useful sometime. Even the sheerest cliffs are climbable if there are cracks you can use as handholds. You might even find some unexpected routes that way. Keep an eye out for cracks on your travels. see their positions on the map. Security at that guard post is relatively light. Looks like the perfect place for a warm-up. Try to remember the ways you used to deal with enemies. Anytime you need advice, just give me a call. Talk. Boss, you don't understand what he said? Uh, I guess that makes sense. It looks like that uh, horn stuck in... Don't leave bodies out in the open. Find some place to drop them out of sight. Processed. They should come in handy sooner or later. 
Why not start gathering them? So you picked up an intel file. Now we know where Miller is. I'm marking it on your iDroid.
got Miller locked up in that town. Check your eyes, Roy, for his location. I hope to hell he's all right. He's not your average client. Yeah. Sun's down already. It goes without saying that darkness is good for infiltration. But your vision will be affected just the same. Keep your guard up, or who knows when you'll bump into an enemy. That's tarragon, a type of medicinal plant. It contains trace amounts of a benzene It's me. I'm here to get you out. Snake. They do something to your eyes? No, it's... It's just bright as all. Send the chopper to get you out. Make your way to the RV. You can check the location on your iDroid. You look well. Age hasn't slowed you down one bit. Not so heavy anymore, right? Magic words, boss. I've been waiting nine years to hear them. Keep waiting, huh? Come on. Save for all. Covering the LZ. We can't land. 
Boss, watch out. It's the Skulls. Don't let them find us. Boss, whatever that mist is, it's all around you. We can't see through it. I'm changing the RV so it's outside the mist. Get over there. The chopper will be waiting. we had, huh? Nine years ago. Carving out our own world. Making our own future. And they took it away. I'm gonna rebuild it. Make a new place. Together. Call home. <sighs> yeah, we were dogs, all right. Slinking around, out of sight for sight. Digging up whatever kind of dirty money we could find. You name it. We did it. You see this? Diamond dogs. Our new home. Phantom of our former selves. Triumph. Death. We weren't allowed either. Yeah. I remember it all.
snake. Why are we still here? Just to suffer. Every night, I can feel my leg, and my arm, even my fingers. The body I've lost, the comrades I've lost, won't stop hurting. It's like they're all still there. You feel it too, don't you? I'm the one who got caught up with Cypher. A group above nations. Even the U.S. And I was the parasite below, feeding off Zero's power. They came after you in Cyprus. Then Afghanistan. Cypher just keeps growing. Swallowing everything in its path. Bigger and bigger. Who knows how big now? Boss. I'm gonna make him give back our past. Take back everything that we've lost. And I won't rest. Until we do. Watch your mother base. have changed, boss. We pull in money, recruits, just to combat Cypher. Rubbing our noses in bloody battlefield dirt. All for revenge. The world calls for wet work, and we answer. No greater good. No just cause. Cause. Cypher sent us to hell. We're going even deeper. I know. I'm already a demon. Heaven's not my kind of place anyway. Dogs of war for nine whole years. That ends today. Now you're not sleeping, and we're not junkyard hounds. We're diamond dogs. Let them talk. Build the army that can do it. Just one thing, Kaz. This isn't about the past. We're fighting for the future. There's something I want to talk about. 
concerns the running of Mother Base. Come meet me. Okay. This base will go for them, not me. This base belongs to you now. Make diamond dogs the force it deserves to be. Like any organization, we need good people, and we need to make good use of their talents. Miller asked me to lay that out for you. To start bringing people in, use this. It's a Fulton recovery device. When you're in the field, use it to extract any soldiers or prisoners you want back here. And we'll see if we can't persuade them to join the ranks of Diamond Dogs. Go on. Test it out on the staff here. Anyone you want. First, put them to sleep. You have a tranquilizer gun, don't you? It's an honor, boss. Out like a light. Now approach him and extract him. Good. Extraction complete. You can only bolt and recover someone if they're not resisting. No dead bodies either. They don't make great recruits. The staff member you just extracted will be assigned to the team best suited to his abilities. See for yourself. Open your eye droid. Select staff. So that staff member was placed on the R&D team. The R&D team is in charge of developing all kinds of weapons and items that will support you on missions. Take a look at the development list. Select weapons items under the development heading. That's the R&D team's development list. See the item called Cardboard Box? Didn't seem much use to me, but Miller was adamant that you'd want it on the list. The last word in infiltration technology, or so he said. In any case, we don't have the manpower to develop it just yet. We need more staff on the team. Go extract a few more people. You can also Fulton extract individuals you've knocked out. Why don't you try knocking someone out I'm with ready, CQC boss. next? Show them how it's done, boss. Try throwing them. It's the best way to knock someone out instantly. Excellent, boss. Now extract it. Good. Extraction complete. One thing I should mention, a Fulton extraction won't always be successful. If the person is injured, the shock of it could kill you. And if the weather's unfavorable, well, it could end up going missing. You can determine the chance of success by approaching the person you want to extract. If you want to be sure you can get them out, best carry them to the chopper instead. All right, extract the next staff member, boss. Now that we have more people on the R&D team, its level has gone up. It should be able to develop the cardboard box now. Open your eye droid. Select weapons items under the... Now select cardboard box and start development. Just be aware... Development has finished. You can have the support unit supply you with weapons and items you've developed. Think of it as your own personal delivery service. Staff members you extracted were all placed on the R&D team, but that was Miller's decision. If you think they belong somewhere else, you're free to move them around. Well, that about does it. You won't make any GMP or find recruits hanging around here. Board the chopper when you're ready for a mission. Open your eye droid and select a landing zone to tell it where to pick you up. Or if you're still in the mood for knocking guys on their asses, you can stay around here a while. Give the men some practice. They'll just come pay me a visit.
know you have a good backlog, but I've prepared a list of missions for you. Open your eye droid. I've taken the job offers Diamond Dogs has received and made a list of those I want you to consider. Which ones you accept is your call. The objectives of the missions I've added are prisoner rescue, facility sabotage, and high-value target elimination. Probably all a walk in the park for you, but they should help you get back on your feet. I put the mission details on a cassette tape. Refer to it if you decide to accept the mission. We'll receive GMP for completing missions, and extracting soldiers and prisoners will boost our ranks. Building up Mother Base is the first step to achieving our goal. If that means wet work, so be it. We're gonna have to get our hands dirty. I hope you're rested up, because we're not stopping. Not until the pain is gone. The future of Diamond Dogs is in your hands. We're counting on you, boss.